guys, welcome back. I have another new to me company unboxing to show you guys today and I think this one is going to be so, so cool. Okay, so I did open it up a little bit and I did take a peek at the top. This stuff looks so cool. Okay, so this is a brand new company and they just launched their website and um, I just think they have some just really, really cool stuff. Now, I did overbuy, I overpurchased because I have been anticipating this shop opening for a long time. So, I'm going to go ahead and tell you I'm not keeping all this stuff and all this isn't for me because some of these scent profiles um, I knew probably wouldn't be for me. But these products, they looked so cool. I just wanted to see them. I wanted to get my hot little hands on them. And... Um, I just wanted to try them. So um, anyway, let's go ahead and get in the box. And I think I left my scent description list over there on the other side of the counter, so I might have to go grab it. But anyway, look at the look at this box. Look how cute it is. Okay, so I didn't. I don't think I said yet. This is Candy Witch Crystals. How cute is that box? Okay, so this is the card. I think it's so freaking cool. Okay, and it also has a coupon code in there with it. And then it came with these little rock candy sticks with lollipops. I just, I mean, you've won me over already. Like, just, just popping the top open on the box. And just the aesthetic of this box is just adorable. It's adorable. And the website, to, okay, I haven't told you guys this. It doesn't really matter, but... I used to be a web developer, um, a web page designer in a previous life. Um, I didn't do it very long because that's what um, my job was when um, when I got married and right before I had my kids. So um, I quit work and decided to be a full time mom. But um, so I just I really appreciate good looking websites and uh, graphics and things like that. And so I think she has an awesome website and it's it's closed now. It's down now. Um, after her launch and um, I think she must have sold out of most of her products, but Just just all this stuff. I'm just so impressed and I've been impressed with her Instagram So anyway without further ado further ado and further rambling Let's get into the products and I'm just going to scoot this back here I'm also going to go ahead and um, grab my scent description list All right, okay all right, so here we go. All right, so this one I got. Um, I got some. I think scrubs or body butters. I, I don't remember. Um, y'all, I went just went crazy. Um, when she launched, because I just wanted to get a whole bunch of stuff to try. Okay, so this is the Tooth Fairy Floss Body Butter, and this one is scented in berry jam, marshmallows, and a splash of sweet dreams. Now, I think most of hers, her scents are custom blends, so they're those kind of complex scents that, I think people that do that, they're just really talented, and they're, they're custom, so they're not going to smell like anybody else's scents, and so this is sweet, but it's got like undertones of just like different things you can't pick out, and that's really cool, but it smells really, really good. And so I guess a lot of times the descriptions kind of escape my um, being able to translate it to you, but it's a really pretty scent. Okay, so this bath bomb is really pretty. It's um, like an indigo, kind of between blue and purple, super, super sparkly. This one is the Coco Moon bath bomb, and it's scented in sugary florals, pistachios, and gourmet marshmallows. That's the little label on the back. She's got all of hers listed with all of her ingredients. Um, I can't really smell this. I can smell it a little bit through the package, but it is sweet, but it does have um, like a discern like a non-discernible scent. Um, I can't really pick out, like I said, it's a custom blend, so it is very different, but it's also, it's really, really pretty. Pretty scent. It does look a little more purpley, I think. Okay, so let's look. Okay, so this has this really, really cute little sample on the top. It looks like it's got two soaps in it and a little crystal for Candy Witch crystals. That looks like, now I don't know anything about crystals, but I would 
venture to guess this would be an amethyst, I guess, because it's got some purple on it. So, one of you guys could probably tell me better. This looks like, okay, this says ginger in the bread house soap sample. And that's got a little, oh, throw it all over the counter. That has a little spice to it, which I guess makes sense. Ginger. Mm, okay, and this one is doll's blood soup sample. That's pretty. It's a little bunk cake shape. Oh, this smells so familiar. I can't pick it out. I want to say florally. That is just so generic in general. It smells like something. I, I don't know the scent description because I didn't order any of this, but um, let me go ahead and move some of more of this back. But anyway, so um, that's so pretty though. That little um, pink organza bag is just so, so pleasing to the eye. Okay, so let's, oh my gosh, this is a huge. Okay, so um, a lot of these are wrapped up. Well, I think they might all be wrapped in pink, but um, so this is wrapped in pink tissue paper. Okay, so I'm really, really excited to try this scent. This is the Strawberry Crushed Body Scrub. Strawberry Crush. Now this is said on the site it's scented in strawberry shortcake, but she said it's scented, it reminds her of the strawberry shortcake doll scent. Now, if you're not a child of the 80s, which most of you guys I'm sure are not, you, that might be lost on you, but I don't know, we'll see. Oh my gosh. Do you can see the top of that? It smells really good. I don't know. It doesn't have that plasticky scent that the doll had, but it smells really good. And I don't know if you can see the shimmer in that, but it's very, very shimmery. And of course, I don't like dig in the scrubs and the, the whip soaps and stuff like that, but um, it's really, really pretty. So I like that. I like it. Oh, look at the little logo on the back. Just, this is just, I love everything about this. Now, I mean, granted, I've not tried any of this stuff, but um, I'm just really impressed so far. Okay, so, well, let's just go ahead. I got another one of, okay, this is a Candy Aura Body Butter. Now, I don't know that I ordered, it. I don't know that I ordered this one. I don't know, this might be thrown in there. I don't know, Dreamy Candy Queen. Yeah, I don't know if I know what this one is. Okay, look at the bottom. I'm just, I'm just exploring, rambling. This might be a long video. Okay, so the bottoms of these are really cute. They say handmade in the candy kitchen, and it gives you the, um, the date it was made and the date it expires, which is really awesome. I mean, the labeling is just really pretty. Um, it's just, it's so cute. It's got like several of her different logos. Now this one, like I said, I don't know that I ordered this. She might have thrown this one in there, but the bottom is white and the top of it's pink. And so I don't think I know the scent description, but the body butter looks really, really creamy. Mmm. This one is really sweet. Um, I may have ordered it though. And maybe I just forgot to write it down because this smells kind of like cake. And so I may have ordered that one, just forgot to write it down. That smells really good. Yeah, that definitely smells like some kind of cake. Okay. Now, I don't know. Maybe I'm saving the best, best for last on purpose. Okay, look at the packaging. Look at it. I love the brown paper packaging. But then when you put the little sticker on it, it's just even more adorable. Okay, so let's just get into this stuff. Okay, okay. Oh, my gosh. Oh, anyway, these are... <gasps> Oh my gosh, y'all look at the shimmer. <gasps> okay, now these are, okay, now these are strawberry shortcake, no no, I don't know what it is. They're the Strawberry Crush bath bombs, and they're scented in that strawberry shortcake, this um, same scent right here. These are the matching um, scents. <gasps> look at these, how pretty are these? So pretty, oh my gosh. Y'all, I got, I think I accidentally got a lot of these. Like I said, I was kind of in a frenzy when her website launched, and I meant to get two of these, two sets, and obviously they come in pairs. I think I might have gotten four. I don't know. We'll see. But like I said, I, I'm intended on giving some of this stuff away. So, you know, that's okay. That's okay. 
and I've got a couple of ideas of what I want to do with it. So I'm just really excited. I know this is just, I'm just kind of all over the place in this um, unboxing, but um, so I'm not going to, um, I'm not going to unwrap all of these, but let's count how many <laughs> I've got in here. Um, I don't know. Are those the only ones I've got? Oh, maybe they were singles. Maybe they were singles. Yeah, maybe they were singles and I got four. Okay, so I'll keep these two and give these two away. That's what I'll do. Okay, I'm going to put these down here then. I'll move these back some more. Because all my goodies. Okay, so that's what I'll do. Okay, so now look. Oh, these are so cool. Okay. And y'all, my family's about to get home from the gym. Of course, I didn't go. But, um, so I'm I hope that they don't come barging in right behind me when um, I'm in the middle of this. But look at this. It looks like a pastry box because I think there's just... See, I love the little theme, bakery, pastry, candy theme along with the bath theme because I just, you know, two of my favorite things. Okay, so let's see what is in here. Now, she's got a lot of waffle bombs which is really cool. And I haven't had a lot of waffle bombs. I've had some. And I think everybody's are kind of different and pretty. So I think that's really cool. Now this one is the Beauty School Dropout, which is just absolutely adorable too. I love that name. Oh, okay, that smells really good. This one is scented in bubblegum. Now that's kind of a different um, bubblegum scent that I've smelled. It's not super sweet. And it still, it smells like some kind of custom blend. I'm, I'm not going to like, not going to bet on that, but it smells a little different. So that's really cool. I like that. And the packaging y'all is just, just so, so freaking cute. Okay. Moving on. There might be, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to see. I, I'm, I'm thinking out loud. <clears throat> Ooh, okay, this one is the one that I just really want to demo, but I don't know that the scent is for me. Okay, so this is her Thistleberry Bath Bomb. It's gorgeous. This is like one of my very, very favorite colors. It's probably my favorite color. And it's got silver shimmer on top. And the notes on this are fresh rain, white florals, frozen berries, and a hint of sweet sugar. So I didn't know, depending on how florally it was, if I would be able to take it. I actually have a headache right now. I've had a lot of headaches lately. Um, so it, that kind of matters as far as what I'm demoing or not, if I can take the scent and how strong it is. But I can't really smell it through the wrapper that much. But I, I mean, it's a, it's a pretty scent, but I can't really detect any specific notes in it, but it's so, so pretty. Okay, I'm going to just set these here and move the boxes, the little bakery boxes right now for you guys. So one had pink and one had white packing inside. Okay, I think I might just have, there looks like there's just one more in here, so I'm gonna move this box back. Okay, so yeah, there should just be one more. There's one more on my list. Ooh, okay. I think this one is going to be so pretty in the water. This one has black packing inside. Now, this one is her Cosmic Crunch Bath Bomb, and it's kind of like a wine color, and I think I've seen either a picture or a little demo on her Instagram page. This looks so gorgeous in the water. Okay. Ooh, okay. So, this one, let me read you the scent description. Okay. The scent description for this one is sweet, juicy berries, mascarpone cream, cheese frosting, and vanilla cake batter. This smells amazing. Oh my gosh, I think I smell like all of that, all of that in there. It has got berries, but it's definitely, I definitely smell the cake batter, and I think, y'all, I smell cream cheese, which is really weird. This smells amazing. This might be the first one that I do. That is just so, so pretty. Oh, I love it. I love it. 
Okay, so I don't know when her shop is going to reopen. I don't know. I don't know. Um, let me pull this back. I'm so bad at these unboxings, you guys. I'm so bad. Um, <clears throat> but I'm, I guarantee you that I will put some of this in my Valentine's giveaway. And um, I will definitely be demoing a good bit of this. Um, just moving all this around. And then, um, like I said, I've got a couple other ideas of something um, that I want to do with these. But anyway, y'all tell me what you think. If anybody out there, um, I don't know if anybody, there are a couple other people I saw that were able to get some of these um, before she um, shut her site back down and um, got rid of most of her items. But if y'all were able to get any of these, tell me what you thought. Tell me what you think, not of the unboxing of my sad little unboxing and my rambling but tell me what you think about these products tell me tell me what you want to see me do first i will probably do the cosmic crunch but other than that tell me what you think is really cool um yeah just tell me what you think okay guys um i will have all of her links listed down below but like i said i don't know when she's going to open back up Okay, thanks a lot. I appreciate it, and um, hopefully I'll have some demos out there for you soon. And definitely don't forget to subscribe because I will have my Valentine's Day giveaway up as soon as possible. I'm just waiting for a couple other items to get in. Okay, see you later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.